Hi, this is Jay Smith. Do you like poetry? Well, you have come to the right place. I've written poems on everything from human evolution to history to running, to sailing, and some stories as well, even in Spanish. So stay tuned, and I hope you enjoy this. And hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Okay, see you later. Hi. What does it take to be happy in life? Well, that changes from person to person, but just as important, it changes for a person over time. So here are some of my observations on happiness and the purpose of life. Happiness and the purpose of life. People usually ask about the purpose of life. Maybe it's just to find a lover, husband, or wife. Two, it's important to find your work. Otherwise, people would think you are lazy and a jerk. Happiness is also much desired, whether you are working or retired. Just strive to be joyful. That's the key. It will work for you and me. The problem is what keeps you happy is not always clear. What brings lots of cheer? People will give many answers or views, but truthfully, they don't have many clues. What makes you happy can change on a dime. You aren't even aware of the shift most of the time. Some say happiness is a new iPhone, a car, or maybe it's to be a rich movie star. Wear pricey things that, such as clothes and jewels that appear to glow. They may bring happiness for only a few days, you know. Remember what makes you happy today may not be tomorrow, but don't let yourself feel the sorrow. If happiness is elusive, look for something new. There is surely something that can bring joy to you. One tip is to consider someone other than yourself. Maybe you could live in a forest like a fat, jolly green elf. You could be a centurion in an ancient Roman legion, sent to conquer a faraway gold-rich region. Perhaps a plains Indian you'd like to be, hunting buffalo and living in a tent in the island of the free. Why not be an Egyptian vizier and give Pharaoh's workers a bit of fear? Possibly think of yourself as a king or queen, the most handsome or prettiest there has ever been. It's not so important who you dream to be. The fun is letting your mind run free. Set some quiet time away from it all. Let your mind roam and have a ball. If you really want to think out of the box, consider yourself a wily gray fox. Now, almost endless are the possibilities. You can be anything you please. How about a crocodile lounging on a river bank, eating fish, working on a suntan, and living life very swank? Maybe an antelope you'd like to be. With fast and nimble legs, you could easily flee. Myself, I prefer to be a tiger, the most magnificent beast. Lots of prey would be my feast. So here's to happiness every day. It's not so far away.